we're going to go ahead and take a look at Wi-Fi. Now, I'm not actually going to go ahead and add a new network, but I am going to just connect to an existing network. Uh, let's go ahead real quick and go to the Options menu with Ocord. Options menu. S for System. System menu. And I'm going to drive down until I start finding our Wi-Fi options. Eject removable storage. Audio. About this device dash short SD. System administration. Eject removable storage. Okay, it looks like system administration would be where I want to be. I'll go back with that one cord. System administration. And I'll go ahead and hit enter. System administration menu. And I'm going to drive down with that four cord just as I was going down the previous menu. Change settings dash short SS. Customize this device. Operate the system. Wi-Fi administration. Bluetooth administration. Reboot the device. So we have a couple of different things here in regards to networking. We have Wi-Fi administration and Bluetooth administration. We actually have two different Wi-Fi menus. Wi so this menu does give us some, some good options. I'll go ahead and go in here to... Wi-Fi administration. I'll hit enter. Wi-Fi administration menu. And I'll down arrow here or dot four cord. Add network. Switch network. So let's just talk about adding networks really quick. It's pretty simple. You basically do the password in grade one or computer braille but after you get a network added disconnect from network. you can disconnect from that network and I feel that'll really save some battery so let's go ahead here and down arrow again Forget network. Test network Add network. Switch network. that would say switch network what's uh, that gonna do for us? some of these networks were here previously as I got the unit I feel like with some testing that Blazy had done so I'm gonna go ahead and down until I get to mine which is called the nest and I'll go ahead and hit enter here it's vibrating and we're connected to the network now so that is really pretty cool to be able to just go ahead quickly and connect to the network. And now we have a couple of different things. I'm gonna go ahead and hit a Z chord with a dot seven to get back to the editor. Welcome screen is open. And there we have the welcome screen, which is in the editor currently. I'm gonna go ahead and go to the options. I'm gonna to go to the applications and we're gonna take a quick look at the dictionary. The dictionary does require Wi-Fi to be active. Options menu, applications. Applications menu. BT alert dash short voice command. I'm just driving down with F4 cord, of course. Dictionary. There we go. We'll go ahead and hit enter here. Word. Now we're in where we can type in grade one braille a word. So why don't we just type word and see what it says? W O R D. Enter. Now, before I hit enter, it may ask us or tell us that the server is not responding or something about the server. That's what it says when Wi Fi is off. I should be in a good location in the house to do this, kind of close to the Wi-Fi. So I'll hit enter and we'll see what happens. Four meanings found for word. And there it is. Again, really quick, pulled that up here, and we can just go down with F4 chord. Meaning one, word now dash has 30 definitions. The smallest unit of language that has a particular meaning and can be expressed by itself. The smallest discrete, meaningful unit of language. Yeah, let's, let's try an EER chord here, one, two, four, five, six, and see what it does. I found in some applications, if you're outside of the editor, that it may not work. We'll see what it does here. Meaningful unit of language. Contrast morphine. Meaning two, word verb dash has five definitions. It works. To say or write something using particular words. To phrase. I'll hit a Z chord. Meaning word. And that word. takes us back to where we would type. So I'm going to go ahead and F7. Indeed. To go ahead and delete this, and we can just type in another word in grade one braille car, C A R, and enter. Look, three meanings found for car. Meaning one, car now dash has 12 definitions. A wheeled vehicle that moves independently with at least three wheels, powered mechanically, steered by a driver, and mostly for personal transportation. Cool. I really find that really interesting and really useful to just have a quick dictionary here. It's something I always wanted on the Braille and Speak itself. I'll go ahead and hit a Z chord with F7. I keep calling it F7. With dot 7. So that's a Z chord with dot 7 to just get back to the editor and exit everything else. 
Welcome screen is open. All right, let's go ahead and now disconnect from the Wi-Fi. So we're going to go to Options with O-Cord. Options menu. We're going to go S for System. System menu. And we're going to go down. Eject, remove audio. About this device tank, System Administration. And we're going to go here. System Administration menu. And I'm pretty sure I probably could hit W to go to Wi-Fi. Let's see if that works. Wi-Fi Administration menu. Great. Let's go down this menu. Add network. Switch network. Disconnect from network. Let's disconnect. I'll hit Enter. Nest. I'll hit enter again. Disconnected from the nest. And there we are to save battery. So that's the Wi Fi, kind of how you get into it, and a quick look at the dictionary, one of the apps that does require Wi Fi as well.